right, today we're going to work on this Reindeer Glow Christmas Digital Backdrop from Squidgy. Um, I'm going to show you what you get. So this is the first uh, one you get, and then you get an extra antler to put in the background, I mean in the foreground, a couple of stars to add, and this is some snow, and this is the layer mask if you decide to put it um, and clip it onto here. So first I'm going to show you how to uh, just clip a photo in. So first we're going to grab this mask, and we're going to drag it over and put it right here in the middle here. And then I'm going to grab one of my fo uh, photos. And then I'm just going to use the move tool, grab it, bring it over here. And then in anywhere in here, you're going to right click and create clipping mask, command or control T. And then we're just going to resize it to however you need to and move it around. And let's say like, um, like, I like it like this, but you can still see the photo thing here. So what you could do is you can go to the layer mask, do command T, and you can actually just shrink it down. Or if you hold shift, it'll just bring this down a little bit. And you can bring this in up a little bit here. And push OK or the checkbox. And that's how you do that. And uh, But I'm, I'm going to show you another way. So I'm going to take these out real quick. And another way is you can just um, get a photo photo, and then I did select and select subject and I already selected it. And then you use the move tool and you go anywhere in here and grab the subject and drag it over. And then you can put it in and then you have to do command or control T. And you're going to resize your subject and you can put them right in here. Whoever you think will match. Oops. Checkbox or okay. And then I'm going to put a layer mask on that. Push B for brush. Make sure it is on black. And then I'll lower it. And I'm just going to take some off because of the snow here. There we go. I'm going to have to actually lower her down just a pinch here. Make sure she's in the snow. Um, and then what you do is you can grab the antler and you can do this with the other option too. I just wanted to do it with this one and then just bring the antler in. There we go. And then you lay, lay it on top and then you can bring the star in by moving it over. And then you're going to change the blend mode to screen. Command control T and you can put that anywhere and to make more. You do Command or Control J. I'm going to do a couple of them. Command or Control T, and then I can drag them. And then always put the checkbox when you're done. And this one here. I think I have one more. Command or Control T. Yep. And then I'll put this one about here. Move it down. Perfect. And then the snow. You do the same thing, move tool, grab it, move it over, and then place it. Make sure it's going to be, and as you can see, it looks messed up because of what I didn't do is I didn't have it on the top. So you got to make sure you drag it up to the top, and then you're going to do the blend mode again and do screen. And if you want, you can put a layer mask, and let's uh, say that you didn't want it, like it's on the subject's eyes, you could take it off. Um, the next thing, actually, no, that's it. And um, this is where you could, uh, you know, you make sure everything's good. Then you um, put it down. Oop. There we go. And then you're going to right click and then you flatten your layer. And then you do um, file, save as, and then you save it and you're all set. Oh, and you can also add your actions at this point if you need to add actions. Um, but yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you.